Oh, the other, the other avenue where I tell, especially with so many 2020 leagues around the world these days in so many countries, is that you're a great player, um, there and thereabouts, the auction comes up and you go for a hundred thousand US dollars and you go, oh yeah, it's okay, hundred thousand dollars, you know, blah, 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 but anyway, I'm, I'm employed. And then um, a guy who's had a crap season all of a sudden gets two million US dollars and there you go, the tournament starts and you're scoring all the runs, you've got 50, 100, blah, blah, blah. You're winning the games for your 2020 team, absolutely on fire, everybody's loving you. And you're sitting in change rooms um, on 100,000 US dollars and the guy next to you who's on two million has got a duck, a one, getting all, getting all the kudos, getting the big name, you know. And so you have this sort of, sometimes this, this change, room, change room jealousy of like, well, you know, he's on way more money than me and I'm not getting much, but I'm performing. And that's also another vulnerable um, part of, um, of young sportsmen is they get a little bit bitter, they like get a little bit jealous of what other people are on. So they're like, well, how do I find more ways of making money? And that's also been an avenue for players to get involved. And um, certainly, you know, again, if, if, if a powerful person involved in that world sees someone not get much money at an auction, they will sort of keep a closer eye on them and whether they'll, they'll be willing to uh, be approached at some point.